Natural gas really is a, is a localized market because of the transportation issues. Uh, natural gas is a vapor. Uh, <clears throat> we're not building pipelines from Russia to, to the U.S. to transport natural gas. Basically, all the natural gas America gets comes from one of three, three sources, Canada, the U.S., or Mexico. <clears throat> However, our reserves have been declining at an astonishing rate. Uh, in uh, 2000, or I'm sorry, in 1980, our natural gas reserves uh, we were 12 percent of the world reserves. Today, it's around four percent. U.S. natural gas production peaked in 1973, and it's not a coincidence that uh, natural gas production peaked at the time that uh, oil production in the U.S. peaked. They both go hand in hand. <clears throat> we have, so in, in America, we have reached peak production. And we reached that at the same time that oil peaked in the US. Two years ago, natural gas hit a record high of $16 per MCF. The age of cheap natural gas is, is, is long gone. We are now going after uh, what we consider to be Un, uh, unconventional uh, natural gas. In the past, all you had to do was when, when we were exploring for oil and we stuck a drill bit into the ground and you had a gusher, some of that gusher was also natural gas. Natural gas stays at the top of the, of the oil re reservoir. It's like, a, it's like a bottle of Coke. Um, if you shake it up and you, and, you cr and you open it up and you get that <clears throat> carbonation that shoots out, well, that's, that, that is the, that's natural gas. However, um, as our oil fields have peaked in the U.S., uh, getting conventional natural gas is getting harder and harder. 